Hi guys, welcome to the unboxing and quick review of this Amorno foldable wireless neck band headphones. These are the style which we have been using like usually a couple of years ago, I mean not long time ago, but actually as far as I have seen until Apple came out with these AirPods and now a lot of people have switched to the AirPods but they have a lot of disadvantages I mean something like this has way more power and I think it's really a good idea to still keep going with something like that the AirPods definitely are running out of power very soon so here we have a foldable Bluetooth headphone with automatic retractable earbuds it's foldable lightweight and it has a white compatibility with bluetooth 5.0 and it really sh supposed to be last the whole day with the battery is something which you don't have with the airpods they are sweat proof and yeah should be great for sport and it has also a vibration reminder for incoming calls. I mean, as far as I know, the airports do not have any kind of vibration. And they are pretty cheap. I mean, they cost at the moment around $30. So, I mean, that's way below for everything which you can buy in an airport design with even less power and this is much more powerful so let's check out what we get and how it looks we get even this really nice portable uh, travel case here we get some information if you need that maybe i show it really quickly to you so if you are interested in more information or if you already bought it and you lost the instruction that could be for you you just have to hold and see the video i'm not holding it uh, too long so if you really need information you have to pause it so that's already it and let's check what we really get as you can see we get this nice holder which you can attach to almost everything and here we have it with looks like we get a charging cable so here you see everything what we get like this nice box the micro usb charging cable some replacement earpieces or i think as far as it looks they are different size probably the one which are on the headset or medium size and we get extra large and small so here you get also one year of warranty and there's even support email hope you can see that that's pretty cool so I have never had such a headset I have to tell you I've always been watching them and they were a little bit too expensive so now since the Apple came out with the airpods so i thought it's a really good opportunity to go with the previous trend i mean now they are grown up they have probably gone rid of all the problems which first generation had and price has come down and so i thought i give it a try so I had them already on, I mean not the earpieces but just wearing over my neck and it felt really comfortable and I was a little bit moving around like jumping up and down and they felt, I mean it felt really secure, didn't have the impression that it could fall anytime soon. I mean I think the idea is that the weight most of the weight is down here so it's almost impossible to lose them you would have to do crazy things like a somersault or something like that here we have the 
um, some buttons on the side maybe to take a call and that's probably volume up and down I try to focus a little bit closer on off obviously here they call this the multifunction button and of course this is the chord retraction button which we have on both sides so if you pull this out and make this a little bit wider so you can see that and when we pu push here it should retract as you can see yeah it works pretty well yeah and how far can we go yeah pretty far i mean that's definitely more than usually needed so it works really good so yeah maybe it's it's advice to not let it just go but hold it i think that's probably a little bit more safe on the long term here we have the microphone i think the microphone is just on the one side on the other side there's no microphone so it looks like it's not stereo but at least we have a microphone and here we have somewhere the charging port yeah here it's on the back side it is nicely protected let's open that so it is attached to the like headphones itself so you cannot lose them the protection so so hope it's focusing and you can see that now how this looks i really like that when it's attached so you can easily push it back you don't lose that yeah it's a little bit, bit difficult behind the camera but it should work so it's uh, already back and not visible that it has been open you can see here right side here probably L for left side so I've been reading a little bit in the instructions and I have found some pretty cool stuff that it has some EQ shift which means you can change the sound setting like you can uh, change different sound effects like low bass boost normal high pitch boost and so on and yeah you can do really a lot with this multifunction button like end call reject call call transfer last number play pause track voice style you have yeah even voice style and it will give you uh, the battery level when you turn it on it will say how much battery is left inside your uh, ear pad or earphone so that's a really cool thing and they it instructed how to pull these things back I think you have to somehow hold it on both sides and then make sure these cords go through your hands so you can uh, make them a little bit slower going inside something like that I mean probably over time you will get used to that so I will now charge them after that connect them use them I will also give you a sound sample from the microphone which I always do when I review earphones so the headset is now fully charged didn't take too long I think it was about two hours but I didn't check in detail I think it was about the time what they are saying in the manual so let's turn it on and see how easy we can connect here's the switch to turn it on and let's check here we see already blue and red so let's see if we find it on the mobile phone so here we have it already it didn't take too long two or three seconds we click on that now let's check if we have to enter code pair yes allow access to contacts and call history so it says it's connected and battery is 90 percent so maybe i took it too early i had the impression that the 
red light was off but uh, yeah maybe it's just the f uh, first time so I'm not complaining about that looks that's pretty that was pretty easy and now I will listen to the music of course I cannot show that on the video of course but I will make a phone call after that and I will record that and I will put that in the video so you can listen to the quality of the microphone which is or could be important of course for you to make a buy decision to access your account please enter your pin followed by the pound key test one two three four five test one two three four five to access your account please enter your pin followed by the pound key test one two three four five test one two three four five so we are now close to the end of the test and that's my experience now I, I hope you have been able to hear everything the sound recording sound recording was definitely above average and definitely better than everything what I've been able to hear from these small like uh, airport similar devices which you have only in your ear so of course the advantage is that this microphone is way closer to your mouth than everything what you just have in your ears and yeah it's really comfortable to wear i mean maybe not same thing as a whole in a really small device but there are a lot of devices which are a little bit larger the thing is with these really small devices they are not very powerful the battery lasts only for a couple of hours while this lasts the whole day so this is really one of the big advantages and also the ear pieces they are super light i mean it's nothing to compare to with everything i've been uh, able to see and i think even the airpods from apple they have no chance to compete with this light so overall it is a really good thing i mean what's also important the sound quality sound quality was super good i mean it had really a deep a ultra deep bass strong bass sound one of the best sound which i have ever heard and at this price range this is really nice so on the downside there are also some problem with this device especially what i don't like is these plus and minus buttons there are a little bit hard to find i mean there's so much space on this device and they put so such small buttons here i mean you can get used to that usually you go down and you yeah this the on off button is easy to find and then these are the next buttons below but it's it's really hard to uh, find or to di distinguish between the minus and the plus and if when you're playing just around with the sound volume plus and minus every time you i mean you have to long press for volume up or down and every time you do that with every level you change there will be a confirmation beep and this is based on the sound level so if you're on a low sound level and changing it it will be a low level beep if you're on high level the beep will be really loud i mean if it's on the highest level the beep is almost hurting your ears this is something which is really not needed i mean but this is with a lot of Chinese brands. You have these really annoying beeps for every button you press. This is absolutely not needed and you can't turn it off. This is super, super annoying. I don't get it. I don't see why this would be necessary. And you have to really long press to change the volume. So I, if I could choose, I would make a short press uh, to change the volume up and down and maybe a long press for go back and forward in the track but it's exactly the opposite like it's a short press on the plus it goes i think to the next 
track with a short press on the minus it will go back to the last track for me it is a little bit annoying I mean I've, you can get used to that no problem but I ended up a lot of times when I wanted to change the volume with changing the track but still I mean you get really a lot for the money and I mean it's a beautiful device I mean it looks really good I've been wearing that looking in the mirror and and, and lo it looks really good I mean I like it somehow it's something like which can really upgrade your style and um, yeah it, it, it's good quality I mean also this mechanism works really good the sound is really good the quality is good the battery lasts a long time so if you don't have any problems with this annoying beeping sound and maybe a little bit annoying control I mean yeah these are small things apart from that yeah uh, yeah why not to buy this thing so I can really really recommend it sound is really great and microphone is good and wearing comfort is super good I mean yeah why not to buy so I'll put down the link into the description so you can buy it right from this link below here on Amazon and yeah I hope I was able to help you a little bit with that if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below and I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time